It's got two faces. That's kind of creepy. The Heartless are completely out of control. The festival will be ruined. Don't worry. I have a Keyblade. I still don't understand the, the point to having a room, which is just an entryway. Oh, looks like it's back to actually fighting the Heartless. Which I guess is, to Donald, more preferred. Fuck. Ooh, look at the, look at the shadows. They've got a texture on them. That's cool. And I'm getting a message from my friend. Hopefully you guys didn't get a notification sound. That's a Discord for you. These guys are a little bit tougher. What the fuck was that? That was gravity. Do I have gravity? I do. I just don't have it equipped with anything. I just have the occasional fire and the occasional arrow. Maybe I should edit that. Oh, well, I guess I sometimes use fire can be good if I want to avoid something, you know? Or at least that's what I like to think. We done? We good here? I got a message on my phone. Uh, I've got two different things. What the fuck? Alright. I've got an Instagram notification. I, I hope it's not that spam that I always get. Oh yeah, it's, it's always that. I don't know what that is with Instagram. You're like... Random ass people who don't even follow you will just tag you in a photo that's like, Are you naughty? So am I. Or, Are you 12? So am I. And there's more Heartless. Fucking fantastic. Good job, Jack. It only took us the beginning of another battle for you to get a level up. That is just great. You are literally the best. Or at least I'd like to say you are, you know? Alright, I guess we have to go this way. I have no other idea of where we could go, except back to the beginning of this place, but I don't think this Sally person would be there. Fuck, forgot about that. I gotta take your shit, Jack, which is only one thing, but it's the protocol, you know? It's what we gotta do. Sorry to do that to you, buddy. Let's check this place, wait, let's check this place to once the Heartless here are out of our way. Alright. Man, I'm loving Jack's dialogue, though. He's got so much... Yeah, look at that. He's got so many nice things to say. Like, he's just an inspirational party member, man. I love him. I also like the movie. But when I first came to this world... And by that, I mean when I first played this game... Oh, look at these guys. At least these heartless fit the theme. Uh, when I first played this game and everything, I had never even heard of Halloween Town or whatever this movie was called. The Nightmare Before Christmas. So this was all weird to me. Zero, have you seen Sally anywhere? <laughs> Is something wrong, Jack? No, everything's going great. We're going to have the best Halloween ever. All we need now is your memory. Memory? You mean this? I don't understand the context. Forget me not. Jack, I have a bad feeling about this. Why don't you try something else? There's still time. Nothing could beat what I've got planned. Once we give the Heartless a heart, they'll dance just as I envision it. Trust me. You're going to love it. Man, this is why you sometimes have to li listen to women. They might be right. Jack, why not have these kids star in the festival instead? They both look rather frightful and funny, too. They'd be better than the Heartless. I like how she was talking to Jack. Oh. Thank you, Zero, for disappearing on me. Oh, yeah, I forgot what I was saying. Whatever. Oh, great. I know, I know that. I know these people. These bitches. Yeah, I sure did. A heart. What should we do? Gosh, you really are stupid. Isn't it obvious? Tell Oogie Boogie. <laughs> that girl's voice is very familiar. I don't know the actress. Or voice actress or whatever. But... It's whoever played Phil and Lil on the Rugrats. 
Or maybe just Lil. It's a nice voice, like... I know there's a lot of female actors with that because they're babies, but, you know. It's a nice voice. Yes, this is it. Now, just one more ingredient. We need surprise to complete the heart. The mayor should know where it is. Doug Dimidome? I love Doug Dimidome. Good old Oogie Boogie. That bonehead Jack is really making a heart. I'll be jiggered. That works for me. Ooh, when I get my hands on that... Well, I've got no hands, but I'm still gonna nab that heart and control the heartless. <laughs> Shouldn't he be able to already control the heartless since he's working with Maleficent and her posse? Since he's a part of the posse? That makes no sense. Alright, uh, give me direction. Now all we need is a surprise. I've left that... Oh, that's right, the mayor. Doug Demidome. Let's go see Doug Demidome. Doug Demidome. Owner of Doug's Dimidome. Or whatever that was. He's got a really tall hat. I remember in the older episodes, the hat would just be infinitely tall. Which I thought was funny. And it made absolutely no sense at all. And I got a level up. More defense, and I learned Treasure Magnet. Awesome. Seems like everyone's getting that now. Come on, ghost. Fuck. Alright, so surprise. Where's the mayor? Fuck. Could he have been in the alleyway? Or the entryway? No, he's not here. Alright. So we are going the right way. I kind of just started going off. About Doug Dimidome. Uh... Could he be past the... Is there a way to get farther through the graveyard or something? Because... I don't know. Oh, I guess he could be in the uh, in the beginning area. That's always a possibility. I'm just not sure. So let's another guy or another few guys. Damn shadows. It's okay, Donald. Calm down. I guess we'll see if there's a way to get past through the graveyard or something. I'm sure there is a way. I'm sure we'll find the mayor somewhere. Good old Doug Dimidome. I just feel like checking here first instead of uh, the beginning area. Because then I'll have to go through the entire, like, uh, the courtyard or whatever the place is called. And I know Heartless is going to spawn. That's how it usually is. There's two ghosts. Or maybe there's just one. Nope, there were two. There were literally two. All right, now we're done. All right, anything I can do here? I guess fight more heartless on top of this tomb or casket or whatever. Oh, I was not expecting that, but all right. Maybe we are going the right way. Oh yeah, we are. Okay, that's awesome. We got a skeleton right here, not Jack Skeleton. All right, Doug Dum Dum. Ghosts rise from those tombstones. Check the tombstones in the order the ghosts appear. If you get it wrong, you're in for a surprise. Well, that's what we want, right? Wait, shit. Uh. Nope. Ghosts rise from. Yes, I know. I just got it wrong. My. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. Alright. Splendid. Now look at the pumpkin. Alright. I guess I have to go back over here. Look at that. Jack in the box. I guess that is a surprise. Alright. Fantastic. Thanks for the little mini game, I guess. Well, that was some surprise, eh? I guess it was. Good job, Doug Dimidome. I knew you could do it. I knew you can make uh, getting something from you fun instead of just having to go through here and fight Heartless. To some extent, of course. So I guess back to the uh, to the doctor. I think that's his name. The doctor. 
I would like to say that's his name, because I honestly don't know if he actually has a name. And I guess that can suit him. So I guess let's go make this heart. This artificial heart. Let's do this shit. Yes, this is it. There you go. This time it's sure to work. Well, that happened. Wow, that escalated extremely fast. The nerve of those little hooligans stealing my work. Alright, I guess we have to go follow them or something. I know we have a fight with them, and they're actually very annoying because they hit hard and hit from every direction in some sort of way. Get all zero. Zero. After them quick. Luckily, zero knows who we're talking about. That's why zero's literally the best. Oh, what the hell? They're like bats. Oh, they're like flying ghouls or something. I don't know what you would call these. Uh, not birds. I don't know what you would call them. I don't want to call them ghouls because they're not really ghouls. I don't know what you would call them. Of course, these are obviously just ghosts. Who we've had to fight for a while because Square Enix, or Square Soft, whoever made this game. Ugh, excuse me. I have an itch on my nose. Uh, whatever company. I got very lazy and decided to introduce the ghost heartless early it didn't make another type of heartless which is fine i guess kind of annoying but whatever okay i'm pretty sure my bathtub does not have hands four of them and arms that act as legs and i'm pretty sure my bathtub is mounted into my house that's just me, though. So, um... Not sure how that works, and I won't ask questions. As much as I want to ask questions, I will not ask any. I'll just stay silent. Lovely... Uh, I think... I don't know what you would call these. Could these be ghouls? What is the definition of a ghoul? Because I seem to not understand that. Man, Jack... Jack Skellington also has magic. And he's, he just seems that good. Like, he's got a lot of MP, and he's got a lot of health. And he's, and he's so inspirational. I mean, did you just see that stance he had? He was, like, doing the kamikaze or something. Whatever that means. Fuck. This guy's pretty high up. And he keeps getting higher. Look at this shit. God damn it. There we go. That's why I still have fire equipped. All right, so do we go in there, or is there something else we got to do? Um, I guess let's go this way. We'll figure out what we got to do eventually. Is the mayor still here? Uh, no, he is not. So is there something to do, or? We can go this way. We're getting somewhere, I guess. And we're here, all right. Awesome. Glad that worked out, and that was a pretty hard hit. I know that didn't deal all the damage that's been done to me and everything, but... And I think I ignited a pumpkin. Yeah, I did ignite a pumpkin. And it killed the Heartless. That's awesome. Uh, we got a lot of these guys to fight. How fucking lovely. I better not get myself cornered here. That would not be fun. I think that pumpkin exploded on Donald and Jack. Sorry, boys. Not my intention there. But what happens, happens, I guess. Alright. We're doing pretty good at this world so far. I'm just demolishing these Heartless. How close am I to a level up? Uh... 
I would say I'm pretty far away. Donald's close, Goofy's close, but we won't hear about Goofy getting his level up. Because I don't have him equipped. 